Man, but production is the funniest job for meeting those kinds of people. Oh, it's the best. The other, the other extra, I did extra work on Blue Bloods. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> Tom Selleck? Did you see Tom Selleck? No, but I saw Donnie. Oh, hell yeah. Oh. I saw Donnie. Oh, and there was this fucking guy there, this older black dude who was like in his like, mm, probably, he was probably in his early 60s. Okay. And, um, you know, he clearly had taken elocution lessons or at least knew how to approximate them. Because, you know, he's like always had his fucking eyebrows vaulted, you know, like speaking in a, you know, very like erudite way or whatever. But then bull about bullshit. It was right, always right, bullshit. Right. And uh, like the minute I saw this guy when we're sitting and holding, I'm like, I'm going to listen to every word this guy has to say. Yeah. For, uh, also, a lot of the extras, <laughs> they have their own cop outfits because they do extra work so much. They oh, wow. Just, they go and buy New York police officer <laughs> outfits. I come with my uniform. Yeah. Yeah. No, that's what they do because it's like you can get a job as like uh, – you know, a, yeah. uh, the guy that's permanently a police officer on the background of like CSI or yeah, whatever. Yeah, yeah. Hell yeah. So we're there and he finds this girl, um, I forget her name, we'll call her Gabby. And she was like younger, like kind mm. of attractive, but not TV attractive, yeah. you know. <laughs> like, or she's like, yeah, I'm trying to become an actress, you know. Right, like, that's right, what right. I want to do is I want to be an actress. Mm -hmm. And it's like, you know, I mean, whatever. She's 19. So yeah, yeah. she has time to she's like figure out that, you know, don't she's do not that. not going to be an actress. <laughs> yeah. And uh, this Lawrence guy immediately hones in on her because it's someone that he can spew all of his bullshit oh, to. Oh, God. And, uh, you know, like I'm trying to remember a couple of the hits, but, you know, there was a good one in there where he's like, uh, you know, I mean, I, I, I show up on these sets and, I, you know, I'm ready to go. You know, and I, I the <laughs> one time they say to me, Lawrence, you know. We need you to move up and we need you to speak a couple of lines in this one. And I say, I'm ready. I can do that. You know? <laughs> uh, but they uh, they give me just my sides. And I say, well, I'm going to need the whole script. I need to understand my character's motivations. Oh what is he feeling God. in this situation? You know, <laughs> like. And the line is like. Yeah. Um, has has anybody seen we... the coffee maker? You know, it's like <laughs> she just pokes her head in or whatever. Yeah. It's never. They any... went that way. <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. And he's like, I need to know my motivations. And then, you know, it's like everything's like uh, just filled with all this like bitterness. There's like a, a, a subtext of, 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 you know, jealousy and anger. And there's one time he was like, I just heard him and he's talking to her. He's like, and I told her, you know, you know, I mean, next time you're going to be working for me. I'll be producing on the next one. I'll be directing. You know, you're going to be working for me. So. You know, no, you can't talk to me that way. <laughs> As, uh, I forget who said the line, but my, one of my favorite lines is, uh, I'm going to show them who's never been boss. <laughs> yeah. And I think that applies. I think that applies to Lawrence. But so he's going off about, you know, the whole time. One time he's saying, uh, you know, I've been here since season one. I've been working here on this project together since season one. It's like, you know, you've just been booked as an extra <laughs> yeah. for seven years. Now, yeah. On the show. On Blue Bloods. <laughs> yeah, yeah, on Blue Bloods. <laughs> the show with 19 granddads where everyone has a mustache yeah. <laughs> the mustache granddad show uh Jesus yeah no, you know what so it's like tom Selleck is supposed to play the major uh, the patriarch on that show yeah, he's yeah, like yeah. this like cop granddad and then his son like has a son so he's like the great he's the granddad right and then tom Selleck's dad is on the show too so there's another grandpa Jesus christ yeah. really there's like it's there's like, that wow. many grandpas nine generations of irish cops but the guy who plays tom Selleck's father on the show is only like three years older than tom <laughs> yeah, Selleck in real yeah. life because his math shit. doesn't make any fucking sense but so yeah. after like a whole day of lawrence going off about how much you know everybody loves him or whatever He's talking, he's like, you know, me and Donnie have been working on this project for years together. <laughs> Donnie Wahlberg shows up. You know, nobody's seen Donnie yet. I'm like, oh, that's pretty cool. It's Donnie Wahlberg. And he walks by and Lawrence sees him and he goes, good morning, Donnie. <laughs> and Donnie Wahlberg takes one look at this man and goes, been seeing too much of you around here, Lawrence. <laughs> and just walks away. <laughs> Been seeing like, too much. Oh, of yeah, you. yeah, yeah. He was completely oh, annoyed. My God. And then he goes, uh, he like turns to that girl and he's like, "We play games with each other." <laughs> <laughs> we, we like to joke around with each other. Oh, 